Hi, this is an Adaptive Ink Technologies and Ink Bags instructional video on how to install the HP Pro X Continuous Ink Supply Systems. For more information on this product, go to adaptiveink.com. Um, in your kit, that when you receive it, you'll you'll get a pre-primed, ready-to-install ink tray and cartridge assembly, a small button magnet that serves as a spacer on the door, a small plastic tubing clip, and the front bezel. So the first part of the installation is to go ahead and You'll want to open the printer door and allow the printer, the the magnet, the button magnet, to attach itself to the door. There's a there's an internal magnet that the magnet will want to orient itself to. Then when you close the door, it transfers correctly to the inside of magnet where it'll stay for the in duration of the installation. The second part of the installation process is go ahead and pull off the backing backing film off the self adhesive tape on the back of the clip. And place the clip right underneath the frontage of the tray, about a tenth inch back from the front of the printer, and just press it to the inside wall. And you can see where it's at right there, just below the output tray, about a tenth of an inch back from this little lip right here. After you're done with that, go ahead and go ahead and pick up the tray and the cartridges. It's probably best to go ahead and slide the cart slide the bladder assembly until it's just almost into the almost underneath the output tray and then install the individual cartridges. Once you got them started just slide them all the way back in and clip each one in individually. After the cartridges are in go ahead and just slide the tray back until it's just about at the front edge of the printer. Then you should be able to just grab the tubing slide it into the tray or slide it into the clip then what you want to do is position you'll position there's a strain relief on the tubing that you'll put right inside the door and it forms nice a nice service loop for all the tubing and then you can close the tray and close the front carriage door put the bezel onto the tray and that's the complete installation after the cartridges are installed there should be a warning come up and it'll say HP will provide some prompts. It'll say that they're used or depleted cartridges. Go ahead and just okay the status of those warnings and then the printer comes ready and you're ready to start printing.